have to be able to stand up and be a prestigious man for the type of woman y'all think y'all going overseas to go and get. Y'all saying that like y'all gonna go overseas and women just gonna flock to y'all and be ready to just give you the world and rub your feet. No, because you're gonna have to go over there and show them that you can be a man and be the man that they want because y'all act like y'all so perfect, but y'all still being conditioned by America y'all selves. So y'all going to still go to these countries with an American mentality. It just may be a little different from some American people, but y'all are still American men. I am not of those traditional values that they want anymore. Uh, they want women that are going to cook. They want women that are going to clean. They want women to raise their children and uh, basically not have an opinion or not talk back or what they like to say. They like to choose the word listen to them. Um, so I, I'm not one of those women. I, I talk back. The level of disdain and disrespect that the modern day black woman has for black men is through the roof. We're tired of that. It's contempt at best. On the one hand, they tell us to improve, become better men. On their other hand, they tell us, screw you, we refuse to become your wives. American women, when it comes to the password bros, you might ask like, where did this start? What, why is this going on? They say that they're dusty. They say that they say they're losers. They're not worth keeping. So why are they speaking out about it? Well, it's because they're projecting. They are upset because they don't feel desired. Men are not approaching women or playing games with women like they used to. They've taken the red pill. They've woken up. And quite honestly, if I was a guy or if I had a son, I would advise him to go overseas. Those women overseas, they are watching yeah. everything that the black women in the USA are failing to do, are failing to provide to their men. I recently met two African women off in an app and something strange was up with these African women. I noticed something devastating that I haven't seen in the US of A. I noticed that these women, they had curvaceous bodies. They were very beautiful. They wore their natural hair. <gasps> Eyelashes were non-existent. <gasps> I even talked to one and she said she didn't wear makeup. I said, Ooh. she has done one of the modern sins of America. I gotta tell her to put some hair extensions on, some eyelashes, some weave, and start selling up. Did you know this girl had? She's educated and she was submissive. I was like, ooh, whoa. And I do not see anything wrong with us saying a black American man can come and find the African queen on the motherland. Really? Like, how is this an attack on and black American we women? Are, as mm. We are so tired of seeing that. So when you see a video and the only thing that you pick up is us attacking African American women. I'm and exactly. this thing that we see online where African American women actually want to compete with black men. As an African woman, I'm not like that. Yeah. Because if you are an African American woman who wants to come to Africa and get a man, you need to know that he's the lead of the Yeah, house. You, you're gonna have to be submissive because yeah, not how, submissive how, to be like a yes, puppet. Yeah, but how you're gonna be in a relationship and want to be an independent feminist woman with an African man without having to submit to your husband? It's not gonna work out. It's not gonna work. Yes. Y'all hear that, brothers? African sisters from the motherland, they are looking at our black American women and they are disgusted by their atrocious behavior. Black American women from the USA do not know their role. They are not operating in their lane. Asia women see their problem. African women see their problem. The only people who do not see their problem is black American women. So look, y'all, if you've made it to the end of this video presentation, y'all stop everything right now. Hit that like button, subscribe, leave a comment, and share this video. Y'all get the passport, bros. Get to Asia. Get to Africa. Find you a better caliber of high-quality woman. I'm out.